Okay, so here we go. The sword is going, but check this out. Woo! All right, so here we go. We have Ring Goku's flaming blade. Let's go ahead and try this thing out. All right, flame breathing technique. Here we go. Oh! oh. What up, Rep Pack? It's your boy here, King Reptar, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys aren't, you know the drill. Golden slash flip. It's about to get a whole lot brighter, Rep Pack, with your boy. Yes. And today, we're gonna have a whole lot of fun because your boy's here, oh. but not alone. Oh. I came with Blade. Yes. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You didn't come with just any Blade, did you? You see it? You see that shine? Oh, I think I see the shine. Gold, baby. First place, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This is a gold-infused Blade, and it's also baked with gold. This was made specifically for your boy, King Reptar. And no matter how much I slash with it, no matter how much I strike, it will always stay golden. That is so sick. <laughs> you know how much I love gold. Oh yeah. So today at Rep Pack, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be testing out some Demon Slayer swords. I am extremely excited. We got them inside right now. We're gonna be revealing them, seeing which swords are random. We're gonna be getting random Hashira swords. I'm so pumped to do that. But at the end of the video, we're gonna be checking out my personal Hashira sword, the Rep Pack Slime Breathing Blade. Right here. I love this thing so much. Like I said, it's gold. And not just that, it is, it's, it was very, very, my, my car is only, it's close. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have a cheap car, so it doesn't really say too, too much, but it's also, yeah, I'm not driving a Ferrari over there, okay? <laughs> but the thing is, is this thing is not even, I haven't even taken the, the Flight Club <laughs> Saran Wrap off yet, man. No, it's still new in your eyes. <laughs> exactly, so we're gonna be taking this for a spin towards the end, or somewhere down the line in this video, but let's get in there right now and check out what Hashira Blades or Demon Slayer character blades we got today. You know what? Before we go in there, let's talk about my Hashira Blade a little <laughs> I mean, we could go talk about some other, you know, Demon Slayer characters, but I mean, come on, bro. This is real life, Come bro. on, bro. Look at, the, look at the drip, bro. This is, I mean, come on, man. Come on, man. Look at the drip. Can't deny the Hashira style. We're going to take this freaking plastic off in the bottom, though. We're going to take all the wrap off. You can't see. Yeah, hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know, let's just go ahead and just uh, put it back in the heel. Oh, like butt. That snap. Yeah. So we're going to go ahead and take it off from the back right here because I already see a little opening there. Let's go ahead and pop that off. Oh. oh. Oh, yeah. Ooh, man, this thing's had a condom on its whole life. It hasn't even really <laughs> lost its virginity yet. The sensitivity is immaculate. <laughs> I know. Oh, <laughs> busted all over your chest right there, dude. <laughs> okay, so, I mean, you're going to see the sword a lot after this video, too. I mean, I'm just going to have it around with me. It's kind of going to be like the unboxing knife, but just the, the killing sword. <laughs> right now, though, we're going to take this out, and we're going to put in whoever sword we have underneath here, along with whatever else is under here, because it looks like this is shaped like a... What is that shape like to you? It looks like a really really big top hat. Mitchell built me a, put a top hat that looks like that on my head. Now you see it. Now I don't. So we're gonna do the reveal right now. Let's see what we got. Last video we did Shinobu. And if you don't know about Shinobu, you have to start with your lips. Let's just Shinobu. That's how you, you have to move your lips from this side to this side while you say Shinobu on this channel. It's because, a requirement. Yeah, because she just so damn. I mean, she's a great woman. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that one. Oh! Bot on. Oh! oh! And then also, we use the beast breather himself, Terry Crews. Terry Crews? I mean, Inosuke. Three, two, one. <laughs> Three, two. Oh! Oh, I got it! <laughs> There we go! Woo. And then last but not least, surely not least, because this is a show basically, Tanjay Ro. One. Oh! One. Oh! oh dude. You hear that sound? Yeah, that was clean! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Let's do the reveal. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh. Ooh, and we got some more drip. Who do you think it is? I'm thinking it's the ladies man himself, Zenitsu. That's what I also think. <laughs> So the blade, I'll put the blade on next, but let's go ahead and check that out. So we have the tassels back here. And I already know, guys, that these swords, I mean, that's why we're going to be using my sword a little later, because it's really freaking dope. But these swords, they're made mostly for display pieces. So they're not extremely sharp. I sharpened them as best as I possibly could. But at the end of the day, they're made out of like a lower grade carbon steel. So you can only do so much with them. But we're going to be trying out as much as we can with them. Even if we break them along the way, it's going to be some fun. But here we go. Ooh. Yes, we got the thunder on his blade as well. The hilt is absolutely perfect. I love the the steez, the steez in the back with the uh, with the ribbon. Oh yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna put that down. You hear the ring on it too. 
Oh, I liked snappy. it. Snappy. I liked it and it put the ring on it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so we also got this Ferrari. Dude, check out the quality. Oh my god. Because you know, we've used some on the channel before. I think last time we had one, it was kind of like the inside was like white and it was like a, a spandex material. True, yeah. It was kind of like, oh, this is printed, kind of I feel like there's stitching in that. There is embroidery. <laughs> oh my god. I'm trying to find the top. Come check this out. Oh there is embroidery. God. The goodness is in this. The detail. <laughs> Squilliam, you've outdone yourself. <laughs> Let's put the Harori on. And I gotta say, man, it is so much cooler. Like the uh the airflow in this one is so much better than the spandex. Bro. Oh yeah. This Looks one's it. sick. <laughs> so, I mean, honestly, I would wear this kind of stuff like to the store, and the reason why is you just feel powerful. Alright, with the sword. Here we go. We got Zenitsu's uniform pretty much good to go. We're gonna go outside and do some tests that are related to Zenitsu. And not just that, dude, we're gonna be using only yellow targets today. Nice. <laughs> let's go out there and let's get started. All right, so we are out here with Zenitsu's blade and man, I am excited to do it. Like I said, these are not necessarily super sharp. We are gonna try it out though. We're gonna probably do have to do a lot of stabs with these targets. Let's go ahead and do it. Our first yellow targets here. We got freaking bottles of Zenitsu's hair dye right here. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go ahead and go straight for it, all right? True Zenitsu fashion. Yeah, it got really wet. Just like Zenitsu. <laughs> All right, these have been out here for a little while. I'm not gonna lie, these are our next targets. We got some yellow fruit. But this came from Corona College Heights. Okay, so let's try and cut those without getting sick here. Let's go for the first target, banana meat. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right, next one. Nanner, nanner. Oh, yeah. You won't get an orange at Toyota of Lemon. Oh, I made lemonade. I need some aid for this lemon. <laughs> what? Oh, that was two bananas. I, I couldn't tell. They were so gross. Yeah, yeah. What? Oh, I heard the slap on that. That's disgusting. Don't do it. Oh, I knew you were going to do it. Ah, that's all the potassium has got. Mewtwo be like, hi, it's nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Oh. Nice. You're not down. You're not. Oh. No, I'm not down. He is. Okay, the goal was, I'm gonna be taking down these targets over here. They got a harder metal shell, and this sword, I mean, it is pretty much at its life's end. Or like, guys, this sword, is, this sword is made for display. We got two more here, these light bulbs. We're gonna be trying, I'm gonna try to take down all those targets as fast as I can, and as I'm doing it, you're gonna say light, and I'm gonna try and go for lights out, just like Zenitsu, and hit them without having something bad happen. Okay. And might I also add, these are Red Bull Yellow Edition. What does that even mean? I don't know, they were looking out for <laughs> All right, ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Boom. White. Light. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was. Sick. Yeah, I cut my hand a little. Hey, man, for the sickness. I was down with it. All right, so Zenitsu's sword, I suspected, did not hold up to the test. But we got the, what we needed out of it. We had a lot of fun with it, for sure. And that's what ultimately matters. I think I'm going to get another one of Zenitsu's for my collection. If you guys haven't seen my other channel, ADHD's Life, I'll put the link down below where I collect all types of anime stuff literally almost every day of the week. So go check that out. That channel will be down below. And also, make sure you guys check out another Seeker channel that will be down there as well. And let's get in some Let's get to the next sword. All right, guys, the day is here. The day is here. I've been so hyped for it for so long. You guys have been seeing me wear this shirt for quite a few weeks now. And the reason why is because I've been trying to test the quality, make sure it feels durable. I've washed this shirt 10 times. And look at this, dude. Still fresh as the first day almost. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't even know you washed it 10 times. Secret. I washed it 12. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this merch is now officially available. The official King Reptar Slime Breathing Technique merch. If you guys want to pick this up, I mean, the longer you look at the cooler, 
cooler it gets. If you guys want to pick this up, link will be at the top of the description. It's going to be limited time. And then not just that, there's going to be a limited edition, gray edition, right now for the first week only. If you want to pick that one up as well, the link will be down there too. Check them both out, guys. I would greatly appreciate it. Support the channel so damn much. I appreciate it. Like I said, I mentioned I appreciate it, Parker. I think you need to tell one more time. I appreciate them. I appreciate them. <laughs> okay, I'm telling the outside world and telling my inside life. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. But anyway, let's continue on with the video. All right, sword number two. That went pretty well. Let's see what we got under here next and see if I can top it. All right, three, two, one. Let go, go! Dude. Oh my god, dude. Oh, I'm, I'm going straight for this. I'm going. I'm excited. It's a cape. It ain't even a it ain't even a Harori dude. This dude straight up went out with a cape. He went to Party City and said what's the best thing he got. <laughs> yeah, man. This is it. But what's even more it is with a sword, man. Alright, so I, I love that hilt. This is yeah, this is absolutely insane. Like a pacifier right there. So let's go ahead and pop open the blade and let's check it out. Oh, Ooh, that blood flame, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, that's freaking sick. All right, let's go ahead and put this back together. And now, let's go outside and test out Rengoku's. But not just that, I have a special test we're going to be doing with Rengoku's blade in particular because this one came with like the hilt a little messed up here, as you can see. So I don't really mind it getting like permanently, perpetually damaged. <laughs> I think we have some special test for this one. All right, we got it. Damn, that looks so heroic. <laughs> I know, it looks, you know, he's got such a, such enthusiasm, and it's like, when you have this on, you kind of have to have that kind of enthusiasm. <laughs> we can't be looking like that and be depressed. <laughs> but yeah, I feel definitely heroic. I definitely feel engaged with justice. <laughs> We're gonna do something simple at the start. I saw a mosquito come by, and it's right there. But the sword's gonna be an actual fire soon here, too. But we're gonna start with the basic test first. Go Ren Goku. <laughs> Oh. Oh. oh my god, my go go. What an insane combo, dude. All right, now like I went through the crack, it's actually not that sharp. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was that sharp. <laughs> now, let's set this thing on fire. All right, if we're really gonna do some flame breathing here, we're gonna need to bring out our old friend, Old Reliable. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, he's right here. You guys know it's old fashioned tradition. We always clean out the grill by setting it on fire and bring whatever was in there from the last time. And what else, also the tradition is, is leaving whatever it is from this video till the next one. Last time we used this, we used it on the fondue or the fondant. So, <laughs> go ahead and give it a light. Let's clean it out and let's get started on Rango. Goku's test. Oh, oh yeah, yes. Baby. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's getting cleaned out. We got some spider webs in there, all kind of stuff. Let that clean out so we can use the grill. And then we're going to go ahead and get started on our test. There's a green flame. Check out this green flame right here. Oh. <laughs> you thought you were going to die. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Oh, wait, there actually is green flames. <laughs> yeah, there really was a green flame. Oh, wow. So, you, so I was almost burnt by the truth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it always is like that. All right, now we let this thing simmer a little bit. Let's clean it out. All right, so here's how we're going to make Rengoku's sword actually flame and actually spark. He is the fire Hashira, so what we're going to do is we're going to get this thing sparking and flaming. Go ahead and light it, Parker. Boom. Okay, so here we go. The sword is going, but check this out. Woo! <laughs> That's like... Ren Goku. <laughs> yes, dude, we have Ren Goku's sword right here. We gotta be safe, of course. But do you see it, man? We actually have Ren Goku's flaming blade right here. Oh, I see. All right, so here we go. We have Ren Goku's flaming blade. Let's go ahead and try this thing out. All right, flame breathing technique. Here we go. Oh! oh. There we go. The flame breathing technique. That's a demon. <laughs> <laughs> this is our demon right here. We have taken down our demon. He is disappearing. The sunlight hit him. <laughs> yeah, it looks like the sunlight just hit him right now. <laughs> Wait, let's put him in the sunlight. There we go. That makes sense. We're gonna oh, have to clean all this up. You're making a mess. Yeah. That's what Demon Slayer does. All right. So I think that might be it for Rengoku's sword. That's kind of like a one use kind of move. I mean, he only got one use too. That's it for Rengoku's sword. Don't worry, guys. I'm gonna be getting another one for the Rat Pack collection over on ADHD's Life for the Room. We still got another character. All right, so we have time for one more sword. Let's do the reveal. Who do we got here? Three, two, one. 
What do we got? Let's find out. Let's see. We got who's his? I forget oh, his name. I don't know his name either, but it's Yami Merrick. Oh, oh yeah. That match is perfect with the merch, dude. That is such a good combo. It does, yeah. <laughs> okay, right here it's like black waves. This slime breathing. Oh yeah. That is so sick. This is definitely my favorite character's blade so far. And this character's name is Sodomy. <laughs> Not Sodomy. Sodomy. All right. So this is the blade. I mean, you could have been a product of Sodomy. But <laughs> let's go outside and try this blade out. I'm extremely excited. We have a special test for this one as well. All right. So we're gonna be trying out his blade. We got our green targets right here. They didn't have a green edition of the Red Bull, so we just got a monster. Right. <laughs> Let's go for it. Three, two, one. There you go. Punctual perfection. Damn! <laughs> Damn, that was Don't. true sodomy fashion. Yeah. Oh. All right, so for our next test for Sadame, what we're gonna be doing is, you know, you know, he's famous. Probably we've only seen him in one season so far, and he's pretty much famous for being an ass and trying to stab Nizuko through a box. And I would say, man, he was goddamn accurate. He was very accurate. <laughs> he's kind of like, oh yeah, I'm good at this. <laughs> I'm good at killing demons. <laughs> so what we're gonna be doing today is I filled this entire box up with some of our traditional targets over here. Come on, look in. It is completely filled, and we even have some small targets in the bottom down there. What we're gonna be doing is I'm gonna have a total of ten stabs. My goal here is to try to puncture as many of the targets as possible. And your job, Parker, is to try and guess how many I'll have left that do not get punctured. And you guys gotcha. at home as well. So if you guys comment right now how many items will be left in here when I am done, I'd say right now there's at least probably 30, 40. There's gotta be around the tune of 30. 20 to 30, 40 items in here. So there's more than 10. I know that. Try to guess the number of how many items are gonna be left. And Parker's gonna tape this up and we're gonna start the test right now. Okay, so I got 10 stabs here. I think I should probably... Oh, gosh, damn, man. I was like, man, I spent that much time with the club last night. No, it's glitter from earlier. Well, well, we went to the club earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. I got 10 stabs. I'm going to try my first one straight to the middle because you have to realize it's not that sharp of a blade and we have a lot of targets in there. It's even a question of how many I can even get through. <laughs> okay, so then I think that what's going to be left is a good fashion seven. Seven items? Seven you items. There's a lot of soda cans in there. Yeah. I'm going to go. I'm you got 10 I'm, stabs. I'm going to go with 11. Well, I mean, you can say your choice mattered in this. That's true. It's, it's me and the audience. <laughs> That's true. Okay, so I say nothing because I guess I do have some some uh some favorable odds on this if I'm holding it. So I'm gonna try my best. I'm just gonna pound through as hard as I can. Three, two, one. Oh! All right, let's go. I'm gonna go a little lower on this side. Ooh! I heard it. I got stopped on something. That's two stab. That's three. Okay, we're all the way through. Oh! oh I, I heard, heard a pop. Popping. That's four. That's four. All right. Five. Five. Oh, I see something leaking off the sword. <laughs> Six. Seven. <laughs> oh, I have a cheap shot. All right, there we go. Eight. Oh. Oh, the sword got stopped on something bad. Okay, let's see how many uh, Nezuko's are alive. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm going to do one more stab for the fun down the middle. We have a total of 11 stabs here. Let's cut this thing straight on open. And like Parker said, let's see how many Nazukos are left. All right, let's do it. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. Come wait, here. Oh, the entire thing is filled with fluid. All right, Whoa. this thing is completely filled up. I can already see quite a few I missed though. But let's try and see how many I have missed. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it right through here. So watch out. Oh! oh. <laughs> All that Nizuko blood! God, that's disgusting. Alright, one. That's alive. Two. Alive. This one. Alive. Dead. <laughs> oh, this one's alive too. It's four alive. Oh, that's five alive. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. That's a lot. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Damn, that was a lot. Oh my gosh, you're covered. Did you, did you know that? Did you know that you're covered? I can't see! <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, so if you said 20, you guys are super, super smart out there, like geniuses or something, because I would have never guessed 20. I thought I was gonna do a lot better than that, but I seem like I really missed that whole cavity back there. All right, so now we're gonna be trying out my sword, and we're gonna be doing a very brief test, because I've already kind of, you know, cut the bottoms of these so we can get them ready. But we're gonna be doing a brief test. I'm not showing off everything until we do a full video on my sword here, but let's just get an example of how sharp this thing is. Bad swing on my end too. That wasn't even the sore's fault. I just didn't follow through because I didn't believe it. No, it's just because look, it cut all the way to here, and this is the only part because you didn't have enough room. Yeah, exactly. I kind of resisted. Oh, oh dude, we should never see pieces like that fly. example of some of the stuff this katana is capable of now it's just us briefly testing it but we're gonna have a full length test in this hopefully later but that is my golden blade but anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i gotta go clear all the soda out of my nose <laughs> if you guys did enjoy make sure you smash the like button subscribe if you guys are new here make sure you guys are subscribed and again if you guys want to get the merch it's down below it won't come as dirty as mine but i guarantee it'll last just as long so check it out like i said down below and also check out these three channels right here because one of them is a channel where i open up just all types of anime stuff every single day almost and another channel where it's pretty much my personal life and if you guys have ever been interested in that part of it i definitely recommend you go check the channel out it used to be the Pokemon channel, but it is no more. Go check it out. There's an update over there. But anyway, Rep Pack, I will see you beautiful people in the next one. Adios. Bloop.